what is up my hackers it's digishark here also known as gemmyt1 online and today we are playing i forgot what this game is called so we're playing a game of dwarvens and i don't know why my mind went blank there it's like 3 a.m something silly like that and it's the steam summer sale so i decided to get this game and i think it was hugely because uh i've been watching Yogscast was like three days straight and that sound is still way too loud. Turn you down a bit. So yes, Simon, if you're watching, this is this video is the this series is if it becomes a series is dedicated to you. So um let's go campaign. Okay, so let's save. Oh let's name it. Uh what should we name it? Um, diggy, diggy, dig, I don't know, just name it that, okay, I have no idea what this game is about by the way, <laughs> I guess I'm <laughs> uh, okay, I thought this game was awesome and then I saw this and I was like, hmm, It is an iPad. Baba, I have arrived. That was fun. Uh, what? I didn't even get to read that. You've been a lady uh, about since the day you were born. Okay. Not knowing the uh, same true dwarf should be. I know where your belly. Uh, yeah, yeah, I don't care. Okay, fuck this, fuck this. This is just, this is game. This game, this game. Can I move? This is a point click adventure. Ooh, oh wow okay so this is the world uh, homeland okay let's play let's play the tutorial <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing ooh see this game looks like um dungeon keeper all right uh, this is where many dwarves can uh, learn uh, blah, 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 and take trials. This is a perfect spot to train the very basics of how to rule you and control your settlement. If we we haven't already, we should really look at King Father's lessons in the world map. It explains everything about some stuff. Oh yeah, I don't care. Right. Um, we're gonna drink. Okay. Okay. Uh, look around. Use both the mouse and the keyboard. Oh. Well, the, the mouse and oh oh okay whoa that's a bit so you got the wads to move about and the middle mouse button to uh to zoom and stuff and there's lots of question marks there which I'm guessing are like an army of evil things I don't know Sw spawning oh the spawning pool basic source of light okay so okay the mouse just move the curve to the edge of the Oh, and you can move up and down like that. Okay, okay. <sighs> With the keyboard, it's Wazda. Uh, yeah, rotate. Underground range, not one layer. Sometimes I might want to look up and down. R and F. Oh, oh, that's quite cool. Apart from, oh, that's E. <laughs> I'm using E to rotate. What the fuck? That's T. Oh, F that up. See what I have here on the swimming. Swimming, swimming, pool, and dig. Swimming dwarf. To get him to work, we should select the big order. The blinking button in the menu. Um. What blinking button? For what, which one's the menu? You got like. Oh, how to dig. Dig and explore. Okay. We should select the bot by clicking on it, and then the digger will try to dig that out. Right, let's dig that out. Let's make him practice. Okay. Okay, okay, okay! Dig there! Oh, that. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, I've got to use my Okay, let's, uh, let's dig this out. 
con, con Tech. Yes. Already. Oh, I just got something. Yeah, I don't. I don't want that. How do I get rid of this? How do I uh, erase this? Do I just click it? Yeah, there we go. Hold on now. What is this? It seems we found a big empty room. Well, it's not really empty, is it? Look, look at all that gold. Look at all that gold and stone. So what's this? It's like shit stone. And uh, there's like. I don't even want to know what that is. What's that? Is that dirt? That's an uh, empty room. What is that over there? Looks like gold. Gathering tools by using the big order. I need blocks. Who knows what juicy things can be like? Okay. Dig that out. Dig that out, my friend. Dig that out. Also, we're going to dig these resources out because stone is good. It's good in Minecraft. It's good in a. Uh, Oh, there's more gold here. Uh, looks like a, another room. Okay, so question marks are rooms. <sighs> oh, look. It's a bigger room. It must be one of the older parts of Hellfort. Well, there's cobwebs there. So there going to be spiders and stuff. Oh, look. A wide cupboard. Stone material. Ah, oh, I don't care about that one. Hmm. Right, that's uh Yeah. Did you see the dark coloured blocks? Do not dig those. If you do, we cannot continue. What dark coloured blocks? What are you talking about? There are no dark coloured blocks. Well look, he's got a picture of a What is that? It is like a mouldy cake. Great. Find dig a dwarf. You have earned some well rest. No, he cannot rest. He's got all this to dig out. We do not need to dig anything else at the time being. Let's disable the dig order temporary while we focus on other things. No, he's got more gold to dig out. He will probably need a bed, so. Tired dwarves can rest. We also need beer. Um, okay, so. What's this? Build. Oh ho! Why can't I choose bed? What the hell is this? Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, so you just left me to it. Well, we got one king. Oh, his name is Diggy Diggy Diggy. Uh, Diggy Diggy Dig, sorry. Right, let's uh, speed this up. What we need is to get young. When you get enough experience, they can turn it into any dwarf that we need. Let's open the helm the helm fort button in the lower right corner. From there, we can order dwarflings. Let's order a dwarfling now from Amazon. Uh, oh, right, wait. Let's hold a dwarf now. Use the helm for button to click on the. Uh, okay. That thing. It is talking about this thing, right? Oh, here we go. Here we go. He's ordering now. This game actually seems pretty good. I'm happy with my boy. So, is he going to, like, somehow come out of this? Pool. Is this where they're born? Oh, it's a two-way gate. Dwarfling has arrived. The swim pool is a connection back to the helm floor. This is from the blah 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 appear to be in order. In them. Now we can dwarf and give him a profession. Dwarfs can be upgraded instantly, but get three experience over time if they are not upgraded. Let's click the plus button icon next to his name. This time, I think it should be best if he became a crafter. Are you... Are you telling me what to do? Are you, 
Are you the one playing this game, or am I the one playing this game? Oh, look, I've got 450 jewels and 200 stone. I told you stone's good. Build stuff in Minecraft, build stuff in any game. Click the craft icon and the dwarf and st and the dwarf and destiny will be set forever. Okay. Okay. Um. Oh, here we go. He is now a crafter. Oh, look what we got. We got move order and sell order. Finally, dwarves will be able to do some good. Let's have him get to work and build some useful things for us. Uh, build burn. Is that that? Yeah. Beds can be found. Okay, we need to build beds then. Yeah, yeah, I don't care. I don't care. Ooh, look. Path. Stairs, ladders, bridges, doors, and blocks. Um. Oh, oh yeah, we got... We got upstairs, don't we? There's no upstairs places. We need a door. We need to start like locking this place up and stuff. So if this is the main chamber, we don't want them to be here. That's where is he gonna have a bed? There's something there. There we go. Go on, do your magic. You can strike the earth and blah, 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 resources. Master craftsman can build anything. Build me a sandwich. We finally have a bed. Now the dwarves have somewhere to sleep. They don't want to sleep on the same bed, are they? <laughs> well, I think the king will be having one of them. Uh, they're probably not royalty, so I don't know why the ground is not good enough for them anyway. What? What the? F that, that makes sense. The ground's not good enough for you, and you're not royalty, so you're gonna sleep on 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 the floor. We need now uh, food for dwarves can survive without a proper good meal. Well, obviously, because dwarves drink and eat. That's that's what dwarves do. It's other than mining and sleeping and trying to have contact with each other, I guess. I I don't know. I I don't really. I should really research more into Dwarven. I was more of an elf fan, but seeing as the elves fucked off, they're uh, they're a bit of a prick in these games. And Legolas is all right, but yeah, I think I think my favourite character is probably Gandalf. Just, just, just <laughs> who doesn't love Gandalf? Come on, there are several things that we need to do in order to get food. Oh really? Oh, so we got a scavenger or something? Uh, but first we should... Oh, we could have farms or something. See, this is why I got this, because it's like so much like Dungeon Keeper 2. I'm a huge Dungeon Keeper 2 fan. And look, it's basically... done. I bet there'll be like another dungeon with enemies, with those mages guys. Uh, with the Gandalfs. Uh, but first, we should have somewhere for the dwarves to eat. Yeah, this is the main hall. This is what I'm calling the main hall. Ooh, I wonder if I can build down on that point. So this, this will be the main hall here. Let's open the build menu again and inspect the table. Table, yes. Uh, oh, okay. That's too far. Oh. There we go. Go faster, my dwarven brother. Go faster. Go on, make, make the tables for food. So, is that their health or their energy? Ah, good work, Crafter Dwarf. Now we have a table the Dwarven can eat from. When they are hungry, they will go to the closest table to eat. Well, if I'm going to have it in one main room, they're going to have to go to one main room. So we should always be sure to have enough food in storage. What? Okay. <laughs> So I'll just have a, a massive storage room full of food then. And uh So basically I need food everywhere, more or less. Without food, the dwarves will starve, just saying. <laughs> oh well no shit. Yes, uh, none of you allowed to eat until you build my house. 
Uh, now that we have a bed to sleep and a table to eat at, we should use some food. Uh, we could use some food. Let's look at the dark corner blocks in the middle of the, this room. Oh, it's talking about that. This is fertilized soil that can... Uh, oh, it's 3 a.m. I'm sorry, I can't really speak properly. That is the only kind of block where plants tr and trees can be planted. What? Why are we going to plant a tree in a cave? But since there is no sun on the ground, <laughs> exactly, we need to build something which can provide the energy needed for plants to grow. We need to build a fertilizing a fertilization stone for that. Select it from the build menu. Then we can build it somewhere on the fertilizing I'm going to click play whilst reading this. Get to work, my belly is starving, starting to rumble. Oh, fuck you. Hey, hey, hey. No. No, King. No. I am the one who says what goes. What? Furniture. Oh, okay. Ooh, so you got military magic, I'm guessing that is. With lumber, harvesting, and farming. Let's build a stone. Oh, I have to build it on here. Let's build it here. And let's build it here. Wait, how many blocks can this go up? How do I move that? Whoa, whoa. What the hell? Uh, we now have a set of soil energy provided by the stone. What the hell is going on with my cursor? <gasps> my cursor is broken. No! Okay, so let's leave it to that then, guys. Because, um, oh, I was right. It is only limited to a certain amount of blocks. So that is a little, little taster of um this amazing oh that oh, okay so it does work. Open the build menu, to lemon tree, and place it. So so okay we we were we'll cover farming a little later. If you guys are interested, I believe it's less than uh it's definitely less than like I think it was in under the four it was in under the four pound options on Steam. It actually seems like an interesting game. And I may play more of it. So I'll see you later, my hackers.